what can theater do in the current times? What 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 can theater accomplish in in the modern world that that you see as um, enlightening or helpful for for uh, it to uh, for us what, to at least reflect on our yeah. current circumstances? What you're asking a very very fundamental question about theater, yeah. and of course, to some extent it applies all the way back to the Greek dramatists. Mm -hmm. It definitely applies to Shakespeare that theatre responds to a contemporary world. Theatre takes up issues, um, moral debate, mm -hmm. political debate of the time, frequently disguised in works of history, in, yeah. in, in works that <clears throat> refer back to earlier generations. Mm -hmm. But um, uh, the, the plays are saying, does this ring a bell with you? Because isn't this to some extent what's happening now? And, and, and the judgments that we're making in this play do you understand that these are judgments we could or should or shouldn't be m m making now? Shakespeare is constantly referring to a, a, a contemporary world. Now, through the 19th century, the theatre became a, ever more a, a leader in how um, <clears throat> we define society. I mean... Um, there is the strict morality of 19th century Victorian society <clears throat> being challenged by Ibsen, mm -hmm. who has Nora walking out on her husband and her children mm -hmm. because she is treated as an object, not as, as a fully fledged human, human being. being and it's the first overwhelming feminist work mm -hmm. um I, I mean shakespeare wrote feministically many many mm -hmm. times yeah. and i don't by the way believe that those parts were all played by boys but that's mm. another another big 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 <laughs> question but um shock waves uh when ibsen wrote that and of course um there were censorship groups all over Europe. In this country, it was called the Lord Chamberlain. Mm -hmm. The Lord Chamberlain's office could regulate what was allowed to be seen and not. And of course, the Lord Chamberlain's office said, you can't see Ibsen's players. They are disgusting. Yeah. They are l l l loathsome. They are immoral. Strindberg then went on and did even more yeah. challenging the idea of marriage challenging male behavior but, uh, and indeed sometimes challenging female behavior but but um but um very confrontationally about society as we get into 20th century george bernard shaw is yeah. writing politically um r r r r writing uh, you know in M M major barbara a play about the obscenity of armaments mm -hmm. and uh, at a time when he should be subscribing to um the whole idea of empowering your nation with more and more we we weaponry i mean um Shocking, shocking. Um, Harley Granville Barker, who was a contemporary mm -hmm. of George Bernard Shaw, and I've just amazingly had the experience of doing a Harley Granville Barker play that has been discovered just recently, uh. and I did the world premiere of it last uh. year, uh. that would never, never have been given performance permission by the Lord Chamberlain. Mm. A play that's 120 years old, and we've just done it for the first <laughs> time, because it's about a woman who feels she has the right to walk out on a marriage. She has no mm. rights of divorce. Mm -hmm. She has the right to take up with another lover and not be judged by society but she is judged by society she's beyond the pale she has the right to go away with that lover and live in another country and work as an artist and then decree that that is not working out and then take another lover mm -hmm. i mean barker is writing uh, at, uh, at the turn of the century something that would never never have been given 
performance. Yeah. Now, and you're... at the moment, as we get more and more and more up to date, theatre is more and more the leader of the agenda rather than responding or rebelling <clears throat> theater and to some extent cinema but i would say most of all theater mm -hmm. <clears throat> is saying you might find this outrageous but we are doing things differently and we're writing about different things 